team. So you know, when we lose together, so uh, yeah, I mean, we, we can't we can't score, we can't have turnovers in the third and fourth quarter, and uh, you know, that's what's going to hurt our team. Offensively, do you think there's one big issue that you guys just haven't overcome yet? I know you know finishing the second half has been a problem, but do you think third down conversions is also something that you really need to take a look at? Yeah, definitely. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's what we pride ourselves in here is uh, you know uh, getting those third and, uh, mediums, and uh, we haven't been able to do that this year, and we've been struggling. So uh, it's just got to be an emphasis in practice, uh, you know, to execute our plays better, and then uh, you know perform on Saturday. You no, know, not to not to get picky, but you know, is there anything that causes an offense not to convert on third down? Is it just one of those things where you know this just happens? It's just uh, you know lack of focus, lack of execution. Uh, it's on us um, as players. You know, we got to pick that up, and uh, as being a senior and a uh, leader, you know, we got to uh, feel that with the team and uh, you know pick people up. Over the past few weeks, have you ever reached a point where you've just been completely frustrated? Did you reach a tipping point or a breaking point? Uh, I mean, not really. You know, you just got to keep going. You know, keep going. Uh, keep a positive uh, attitude. Uh, you know, it's, it's not going to help anyone to pout. To, you know, to be negative. So you got to have a positive attitude and uh, just keep grinding and get better each day. Jeremy, what time do you would you say you usually go to bed when you have these morning practices? Uh, as early as I can. I get my schoolwork done and try to get into bed by like 10:30, 9. Um, so do you ever worry about you know when you have you practice this early and you're on sort of an earlier time schedule for your whole day that that affects the team's preparation for a night game for like six o'clock start? No, because uh, every night we get together as uh, uh, wide receivers and quarterbacks and we watch film every night around uh, seven or eight o'clock uh, depending on our class schedules. So uh, we're always up. We're stimul like keeping our minds active and stuff at that time, we're not really taking time off. Uh, do you change anything in your preparation for when you have a leading up to a night game? No, we, we still do this, what we do. Um, I mean, we were playing well the first half, you know, we just didn't finish, so uh, yeah, uh, I don't think there's anything about how we uh, prepare. Then how much tougher is it when you go into a place like Kinnick to then have to deal with a nighttime atmosphere? Yeah, I mean, it's going to be tough. They have a you know, great fan base, uh, it's a loud stadium, so uh, it's going to be fun, it's going to be exciting, we're looking forward to it. On film, what have you seen about Iowa's defense? 